guys so this is going to be a follow-up video from my how I lost baby weight video so this is where I'm going to go from here if you haven't seen the how I lost the baby weight video I would highly suggest you go watch it I'll put the link right there so you can go check it out so yeah I've officially lost all the baby weight I'm actually a little lower currently as we speak right now than I was pre-pregnancy like the weight is really just falling off right now because I'm a bit of a workout junkie and I just really enjoy working out which is not a bad thing to really be obsessed with I would say maybe to a certain extent but for those of you who do not know or don't follow me on Instagram I have joined a gym and I absolutely love it there it's such a community based kind of gym and everybody's just so nice basically what I do is my workout routine I plan on doing some sort of workout routine type of videos on this channel here coming up I typically do mostly classes for my cardio workout because it keeps the cardio really fun and interesting and um, I really feel like I'm being challenged when I'm doing the classes the classes are anywhere from an hour to an hour and a half long and I do all kinds of things on Mondays I typically do step aerobics which is really really confusing when you're not really up to date with um, all the keywords so I do step aerobics on Mondays. Tuesdays are, I think, what are my hardest days because it's almost like having a personal trainer in a way. I do like hit sort of cardio for one hour with some toning workouts. Wednesdays are either Pilates or yoga. Thursdays are Zumba, which is my favorite days. And then Fridays, I typically just do sort of a chill out thing because there's not too many classes then. There are all kinds of classes I can do. I can always mix and match. Um, but that's typically what I've done like the past two weeks and those are the ones that I've really enjoyed. So as far as how my fitness goals go, I think I'm just kind of, I feel like I'm just riding this wave of not really knowing where this whole thing is going to take me, where I'm going to end up, like where I'm going to feel like the weight loss is going to be enough. Right now I'm still currently approximately um, 15 to 20 pounds overweight for my BMI but I do carry more muscles so I kind of wonder if for me I wouldn't really need to go more than another 10 pounds. I'm not exactly sure. I do prefer a more curvy look and I just kind of think that that looks better on me. As you guys can see like I'm quite petite from the top um, and the bottom everything kind of spills out. Um, so I feel like when I do get really slim up here gets really skinny like I get really 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 um, to find collarbones. Really my main focus is just getting into a healthy BMI range right now. I've got another 10 pounds to go before I'm in the high end of healthy. I'd really like to get in like just the right range if you know what I mean like the right BMI which is I think like 22 or 23. I'm pretty sure I'm like a 25 or 26 right now I'm not exactly sure. As far as toning and stuff goes I feel like my muscle tone is really good but I do have a lot of um, fat just still jiggling around so I'm not really too worried about like getting super toned I am doing some lifting I'd say right now I'm focusing most on my butt because I feel like like I personally don't have never really cared for my butt um, I've always thought it's just too big it's too jiggly <laughs> just all those kinds of things um, but now I'm just kind of learning to appreciate it because butts are like in right now and I feel like if I put a little bit more effort into that area I could have a pretty nice butt so I am currently working on the booty area targeting it just kind of giving it a lift and a little bit more of a nicer shape right now it's big but it's um, on the kind of like wobbly bobbly side <laughs> so I'm focusing mostly on my butt and obviously my stomach because I just had a baby but there's not really too much I can do about my stomach because most of it is like a lot of the the jiggly stuff and like the wrinkly stuff is like loose skin and it's just kind of something I have to get used to and get over just like the stretch marks I got so um, not so much I can do besides do some ab workouts. I do work out quite a lot. I'm at the gym anywhere from five to seven days a week and it just kind of depends on how I'm feeling and how busy I am on the weekends. I'm actually going to go today after I'm done filming this so I hope you guys enjoyed. Follow me on Instagram if you want motivation and meal ideas. There will be more meal videos on this channel coming up here really soon. I do plan to focus a lot more on this channel because my kids are getting a little older. My oldest in September is going to be at a daycare from 
8 o'clock in the morning till 2 so I'm going to have a lot of time I'm going to be having a lot more time especially come fall and my little one she's getting a little bit more independent as well I will be sure to keep you up to date on how things are going with my weight loss check out my before and after pictures that I have so far and I will see you guys very very soon bye